be caught in CPO. Mona, help me. Oh, so get one key my picking for me. Oh, with the principal. Oh, Mona, help me. Oh, I don't get anybody. Oh. Mother of the victim, Mrs. Bosel Sagede, calling on concerned authorities to rescue her son from the hands of the army. The boy, identified as Abraham Sagede, is receiving treatment at the Central Hospital Benin. Speaking to the news crew, the boy said he graduated from Ugyomo Secondary School in 2010, and since then, he has maintained his relationship with the principal of the school. He said when he visited the school last week Friday, he noticed that the flag of his organization, Paramilitary Guard of Nigeria was removed from the school. He said upon inquiry, he learned that some suspected cultists from other secondary schools invaded Ugyomo Secondary School and destroyed the flag. The boy said to his surprise, he was invited by the army on Wednesday who brought him before the principal for questioning, adding that the principal denied knowing him in the presence of the army. The boy said the army allegedly shot his two legs when he attempted to escape after he could no longer bear the torture by the army. And when we were driving down to the station, the soldier men started threatening me and telling me all sorts of things that they would shoot me. They will dream me and do me all sort of thing because I brought, brought them to food them. Because of that, they will dream me. As I started explaining to them, they said they don't want to hear because of their, their military people. So immediately, I opened the car and I jumped down for rescue. So I, as I was running, they shot me at the first time. I was still going and they shot me at the other leg. So they shot me on two places. And the soldiers, they forced me to owe the way a placard that was written Abraham baby bed court member that was what they gave me to owe. When contacted on the issue, the Army Public Relations Officer for Brigade, Captain Jonah Unuohalu, who spoke of camera, said the Army got a distress call from the principal of Ugyomo Senior Secondary School that one Abraham Musagede and another were fomenting trouble in the school. The Army PRO explained that after the arrest of the two suspects, the said Abraham jumped from the Hilos van and in the process was shot. Narrating his own side of the story, the principal of Ugyomo Senior Secondary School said contrary to the claim by the boy that he invited the army to the school, it was the boy who invited the army to the school under a false pretense that he sent him. The principal also denied inviting members of the paramilitary to the school, adding that he has no personal relationship with the boy. What happened was that when he came, came to the school, to terrorize the school with his boys, claiming that the boy was wounded. On Wednesday, I was surprised in the morning when I saw four, four uh, military uh, personnel. Four of them came in the company of two boys. They came. They asked, did you invite us? Was there any distress call from me? I said, no, I did not invite you. Then why are you here? They said, these boys came to them to tell them that I invited, that I wanted them to be here. I said, no. I don't deal with the military. I don't deal with any organization. The police public relations officer, DSP Steven Onwunche, said the command is not aware of any arrest made by the army. He, however, said that the police arrested six suspects in connection with the crisis. It is important, I state here, that on our own, over that same uh, issue that happened at a Guillermo Secondary School, we arrested uh, six persons, and uh, as I speak today, uh, they are built to be transferred to the CID. Uh, but we did not, or we have not, taken over any person from the military, as we speak now. The family of Master Abraham Musagede are hoping that concerned authorities will wade into the matter. Best Mbire reporting.